In this video, I am going to explain present participle and zeran. What's the difference between both? Both are forms of verbs ending in ing. That's why you're getting confused. Okay, that is one verb or zeran. We know that ing form of verbs acts as an adjective, part of a tense, and also uh, zeran. Okay, what is present participle? Present participle acts as an adjective. Or part of a verb tenses. But zeran acts as a noun. Okay, ing form of a verb. That is one noun. Present participle. Present participle uses. Present participle describes an ongoing action or a characteristic. Right? What is ongoing action? We use, we express our thoughts in ongoing action in continuous tenses. The in present continuous is in present perfect continuous, in past continuous, in past perfect continuous, in future continuous, in future perfect continuous. That means in tenses, in six tenses forms, we use present participles, right? In continuous tenses, she is running. Running is running. Be verb plus ing form of verb. Here, action going on, running going on. So, running is a part of tense. It is present participle, but it is a part of a verb tenses, part of a verb and in the expresses tense. They were playing basketball. Were playing. Be verb, past be verb, plus playing. Okay. This is past continuous. Playing is the what? Present participle. He has been studying since morning. Has been studying has been studying present perfect continuous. In present perfect continuous, we use present participle. I will be teaching English to you. We will be teaching, we will be expresses future, okay? Be teaching, be verb plus ing form of verb. Present, um, sorry, future continuous. Teaching is present participle. I received the request to explain this concept and truly value your suggestions. So I have prepared this video to break it down in a simple and clear way. Let me know if this helps and feel free to share your thoughts or questions in the comments. As an adjective, we use present participle. The running water is cold. How to identify? Running water. Running expresses, running describes water. Water is a noun. When a word describes a noun, that is one adjective. Here running describes noun water. So running is adjective but it is present participle. It was an exciting movie. Movie is a noun. Right? Exciting describes movie. Says more, so says more about movie. So exciting is present participle acts as an adjective here. The story was very interesting. What was very interesting? Story. Interesting says about story, noun. So, interesting is an adjective here and it is present participle, ing form of a verb. The crying baby grabbed everyone's attention. Crying baby, crying says about baby. So, crying is present participle, acts as an adjective here. Also, you use present participles in participial phrases. Laughing loudly. She walked into the room. Laughing. Laughing describes she. Okay. Pronoun. When a word describes pronoun or noun, those are adjectives. So here, laughing is ing form of a verb, acts as an adjective, and loudly, laughing loudly is an particip is a is a participial phrase. Carrying a heavy bag. She struggled to climb the stairs. This is how carrying is present participle. It is a phrase, part of a phrase carrying a heavy bag. Hoping to catch the train. Hoping is a part of the phrase. To Hoping to catch up the train. So, hoping is present participle. Let's see the use of zeran. Zeran acts like a noun and it takes the position of subject object or complement. Three positions. Let's see as a subject. Swimming is good for health. Here swimming. 
स्विमिंग इज गुड फर हेल्थ स्विमिंग हियर आर्ट सजन एज ए सब्जेक्ट इट टेक्स द पोजिशन अफ सब्जेक्ट सो स्विमिंग इज जेर नट प्रेजेंट पार्टिसिपल रईट प्रेजेंट पार्टिसिपल आर्ट सजन आर्जेक्टिव पार्ट अफ ए भर टेन्स ओके बट स्विमिंग एंड आई एन जी फर्म अफ भर वेन आर्ट सजन आर्ट सजन नाउन दिस इज वन जेर so swimming here takes the position of subject so swimming is one zeran walking is a good exercise walking is a zeran because walking is the subject of the sentence ing form of verb acts as an object in a sentence it takes the position of subject he and sorry objects he enjoys reading enjoys what reading when a verb answers the question what or whom the answer is object of the sentence he enjoys what reading so reading is object of the sentence object of the verb or object of the sentence and it is it is ing form of a verb here it acts as an object so it is one zera the wall needs painting needs what painting so painting is zera he is interested in learning new languages learning is the object of preposition when one ing form of a verb object of a preposition that is one acts that is one noun so learning is noun here this is one zeran as it is ing form of a verb acts as a noun it is one zeran she is afraid of falling of falling preposition falling is the object of a preposition of so falling is zeran her favorite hobby is swimming here swimming is not the part of verb is swimming is not part of verb okay swimming is a complement of the verb is complement of the sentence is mm, her favorite hobby is swimming so swimming here one zero acts as a noun one zero what is the key difference between present participle and zero present participle acts as an adjective or part of verb tenses already i have explained here the crying baby fell asleep again another example crying baby baby is the noun crying is used to describe baby noun so crying here acts as an adjective so it is present participle zeran acts as a noun crying helps release stress the same word crying baby crying helps here crying acts as a um, exists as a subject in this sentence okay crying is the subject of the sentence so crying is an zeran in the um, last sentence the crying baby fell asleep crying describes baby so crying here adjective right present participle but in the next sentence crying helps release stress crying is the subject of the sentence so crying is a zeran how to identify them in a sentence again simplifying running is fun i am running suppose the sentence is i am running i am running okay so running is a part of verb tense i am running present continuous running is the present participle but here running is fun running is the subject of the sentence it is a zeran uh, he is running is running he is running running is a part of tense so running is present participle the running water was clean and cold here running water running describes what water noun so running is here present participle when acts as a verb that is present participle when acts as an adjective that is also present participle i love dancing love what dancing answers question what so dancing is an object of the sentence so it is one zero i hope you got the concept clear okay if you have any doubt you can ask question in the comment below do not forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel thank you